guys, I'm here with Dinosaurs Before Dark, Chapter 5, Gold in the Grass. Go, go, said Jack. He threw his notebook into his pack. He pushed Annie toward the rope ladder. My Henry, she said. Go, said Jack. He gave Annie a big push. Quit it, she said. But she started up the ladder. Jack scrambled after her. They tumbled into the treehouse. They were panting as they looked out the window at the dinosaur. He was standing there on the hilltop, eating flowers off of a tree. Oh, man, whispered Jack. We are in a long time ago. The dinosaur looked like a huge rhinoceros, only he had three horns instead of one. Two long ones above his eyes and one on his nose. He had a big shield-like thing behind his head. Triceratops, said Jack. Does he eat people? Whispered Annie. I'll look it up. Jack grabbed the dinosaur book. He flipped through the pages. There, he said. He pointed to a picture of a triceratops. He read the caption. The Triceratops lived in the late Creaceous period. This plant-eating dinosaur weighed over 12,000 pounds. Jack slammed the book shut. Just plants, no meat. Let's go see him, Annie said. Are you nuts, said Jack. Don't you want to take notes about him, asked Annie. We're probably the first people in the whole world to ever see a real live triceratops. Jack sighed. She was right. Let's go, he said. He shoved the dinosaur book into his pack. He slung it over his shoulder and started down the ladder. On the way down, Jack stopped. He called up to Annie. Just promise me you won't pet him. I promise. Promise you won't kiss him? I promise. Promise you won't talk to him. I promise. Promise you won't. Go, go, she said. Jack went. Annie followed. When they stepped off the ladder, the pteranodon gave them a kind of look. Annie blew him a kiss. Be back soon, Henry, she said cheerfully. Shush, said Jack, and he led the way through the ferns, slowly and carefully. When he reached the bottom of the hill, he kneeled behind a fat bush. Annie knelt beside him and started to speak. Shush! Jack put his finger on his lips. Annie made a face. Jack peeked out at the Triceratops. The dinosaur was incredibly big, bigger than a truck. He was eating the flowers off a magnolia tree. Jack slipped his book out of his pack. He wrote, eats flowers. Annie nudged him. Jack ignored her. He studied the Triceratops again. He wrote, eat slowly. Annie nudged him hard. Jack looked at her. Annie pointed to herself. She walked her fingers through the air. She pointed to the dinosaur. She smiled. Was she teasing? She waved at Jack. Jack started to grab her. She laughed and jumped away. She fell into the grass in full view of the Triceratops. Get him back! Get back here, whispered Jack. Too late, the big dinosaur had spotted Annie. He gazed down at her from the hilltop. Half of a magnolia flower was sticking out of his mouth. Oops, said Annie. Get back, Jack shouted her. He looks nice, Jack. N nice? Watch out for his horns, Annie. No, he's nice, Jack. Nice, but the Triceratops just gazed calmly down at Annie. Then he turned and looked away down the side of the hill. Bye, said Annie. She turned back to Jack. See? Jack grunted, but he wrote in his notebook. Nice. Come on, let's go around some more, said Annie. As Jack started after Annie, he saw something glittering in the tall grass. He reached out and picked it up. A medallion, a gold medallion.
A letter was engraved on the medallion. A fancy M. Oh, man. Someone came here before us, Jack said softly. All right. That was chapter five, guys. We'll keep on going. I'll go ahead and I think I'll do some videos this weekend, too, so that you guys can catch up on it every day because it's getting really good and we are like halfway done. So I figured that'd be a nice way to kind of pick things up and maybe we can get onto a different video, okay? I went ahead and I talked with Mrs. Taylor, our librarian, and she is also having a YouTube channel called Edwin Lowe Elementary. Well, Edwin Lowe Library. I went ahead and I put the channel on my channel. So if you guys want to read even more or listen more, you can go ahead and go to her channel that's on my page, okay? All right, bye.